From the realm of King Ludwig the German came Adelhard, a man who was meant to be delegated to the footnotes of history. A distant family member of the Carlings, the heirs of Charlemagne. Instead, he distorted the balance of power by taking the Italian throne. However, with power taken so quickly, comes the burden of trying to hold on to it. Rebellions erupted across northern Italy with Duke Berengar, the elder brother of the king leading the charge for one of those many wars. First, blood was lost on a battlefield. Now, a second brother expunged from the halls for his treachery. Adelhard learned quickly that power does corrupt. But a calm would come at last, with the king now solidifying his grip on the lands. There are rumors of Islamic powers encroaching and holy wars being planned. For our survival, he'll have to endure many more plots and wars. Now, for our council. I, Sander Graf, preside over this council. Welcome to our court, Thomas. While I understand heathens have invaded your shores, we can't spare the manpower to your conflicts. Let God be your shield and faith your comfort. The king's control of these lands hangs on by a thread. And welcome, Bishop. You need not worry. The Pope shall have his independence, free from the abuses of lords. You call for unification, and that catches the ear of our king. In time, you'll have your station in our courts, for there is wisdom in what you say. We shall claim more of Italy for one army, one king, and one god. Oh. And finally, we have Sir Siegfried. King Ludwig the Younger for now maintains a firm hold over his people. If one day we see him falter, it may be time for us to return home. But for now, we wait and see. This now concludes our second council. We have much to do, and idle hands are the devil's workshop. God be with you. We have King Arnold, I mean King Adelhard over here, the Iron Unbent of Italy, 35 years old, and his wife is only 27. She has provided many children. For anyone who thought being chased was a bad choice, you've got to understand, his little swimmers are quite athletic. They know how to sprint to the finish line. And now he has many, many children. We're going to use them for marriages to really provide a buffer of alliances. And I'll show you why. Over here, we have a man who is not bald. He's a liar. Well, he's a bald-faced liar. That's true. But he's over here. Charles the Bald, 55 years old. That's my uncle, by the way. He's beginning to like me more. He wants my title. I gave him money, and I have begun to sway him. I've got to, because if I do not, he could easily beat me. I've never been in a campaign where, by the time I become king, I still cannot beat my neighbors. But here, I cannot beat my neighbors, not yet. There are a few factions where maybe I could, but have a look at that. They have many, many allies, not to mention a decent amount of money, too. King Lothair. He's only 42. He's going to be around for a while. That's a lot of daughters. He's got an army of daughters. So there's your heir. Oh, he's got a good physical trait. And East Francia, a bit more broken up. 2,500 men. They're fighting another faction. Lusatians right over here to the east. 2,200 men. That's a lot of men. Well, good for them. He's an overseer. And finally, Bavaria. Maybe we'll conquer up north one day. I know there's some very good gold mines right up north, and I could use some more gold if I want to survive. We're going to have to figure that out and really think about what we want to do. But as of right now, I had to spend years trying to fight rebellions left and right. I had to get rid of my brother. He's not dead, but I had to banish him. He's in debt right now. My other brother, hopefully, is no longer in debt. He had a lot of money to pay back. He was coronated by the Pope, which is crazy. My sister, she's doing fine. I've got over here my nephew. He looks like me. Oh dear. He looks a lot like me. That's a bit strange. How many have I killed? Ah, Otbert. I didn't kill him. What are you talking about? No, he was plotting to kill my wife. And I love my wife. And also, she can hear what I'm saying. So, I really do love my wife. She's also a doctor. Only a lowborn. Now, she's a queen. Good for her. If you recall, we did move down over here to Napoli. I'm currently increasing control because I thought that would be a good idea. And also, I would like to convert the local culture. That, too, is a good idea. Now, unfortunately, my old duke, my old spy master, he passed on. He was very creepy. And he spoke like this. Because he was disfigured and had to wear a mask. But over here, I've got my brother as a spy master. That could be quite dangerous. He's a little bit ambitious, all right? 
beyond that, he is chase as well, which is not bad. All right, we'll see in time what he's going to be able to do. And who else do we have? We've got some minor titles. Duke Lambert, that young man who fought me early on. He's 28 now. He's no longer a young man. He's a man. But he's over here, and he's got some power, too. We've got a new champion, Dan. Dan the man. Dan the warrior giant man. He's a giant and a blade master. He's very powerful. We need him, and he's got a giant wife, too. Then we have Helga over here. She's relatively young and has great traits, by the way. She's married to my Chancellor, who's got an incredible diplomacy score at 17. Then we have another fellow over here, the Bookish. He's a super holy nerd. Then, of course, we've got Harold. I had him marry a giant lady, a giant Irish lady. Hopefully, they'll have kids eventually. He's a very good knight. I hope he does well. He makes me laugh, but he also gives a slash in battle. Now... What else do we have over here? We could go on a pilgrimage, but I can't do that yet. I don't want to become Greek. That is not the dominant culture. But we've had many plans given to me. I think for right now, though, we need to unify a bit more of Italy. I do want the Holy Roman Empire, but I don't want to go too far up north. If I do that, I would have to challenge my cousins and uncles, too. They're very powerful. They've got allies over here. And others could attack me. Largely West Francia, the most powerful faction over here. They could crush me, and it wouldn't even be funny. So we'll have to watch out for them. Even a marriage would be ideal. But his children are a little bit older, and they are all married with their own children. So, what should I go after? Benevento would be a great idea. Salerno over here would be a great idea. We've got a few ideas. 14 months to go. Let's try to make it happen. Another party already? Okay, sure. I'll join your party. Quit trying to fatten me up. You look like a fellow who would send people out into battle and watch them die and say, Oh, well. The dilemma. The feast is dwindling down, and I find myself deep in conversation with my witless vassal. Interesting. I could let him become my friend. Sure, be my friend. It's good to have support out there. Now he won't betray me. And he's got some power over here, too. Otherwise, he might have begun his own faction. Wait, you didn't begin your own faction, right? Okay, good. We've got another faction who wants to take me down. I do understand that. Now, if I do that, I could get him to like me more. Or I could gain some benefits to my diplomacy and learning. I'll take that. We'll have a good conversation. There. I've become better. I've become stronger. Oh... Duke Conrad, you want some power? Really now? I don't know if I'll give you that. And what's over here? It's all over. We can leave again. The trait. Interesting. I didn't actually get one. The bishop says the words and so do I, and a sudden solemnity falls upon my gathered cord. I was coronated, but there was no trait. I wonder what that's all about. No idea. No, I'm not going to create a cadet branch. But eventually, I do want 500 gold because I need another title. It's a proper title that right now, the Pope has. It would anger him, but it needs to belong to me. If I want people to follow me, I need those titles. Or I can leave it alone. It really depends. Actually, we should have a look over here when it comes to succession. Right now, my crown authority is very low. We need more innovations. If I die today... It wouldn't be so bad for my children. Have a look at that. One county for each other son, Lambert, Eberhard. For Carl, my primary heir, he would get Napoli and Italy. Yeah, that would actually be great. That really wouldn't be too bad, I think. Let's come over here. What do we have? What are we working on, by the way? Cass's belly? Oh, I do not lead. Not right now. You lead. And your learning is one? I think when he tries to read, words hurt him. He's like, oh no, please, take it away. Another party, buddy. I can't party every day. I would like to, but I can't do it. Evidently, the Vikings are coming after you. What a shame. I've got to help out. I could send out some men, I do suppose. Are we about to get our claim over here? We are. All right, I'll do what I can. Give me a little bit, okay? And I'll see what I can send out over to you. Now, only a few more days to go. 
Done. 57. It's only 57 gold. I've got plenty of gold right now. now. Who's over here? Wait, Harold? You're no longer the fair hair? The tangle hair? What a horrible title. Look at him. He looks awful right now. And his wife is none too pleased. Now, who else do we have? Rurik over here, another notable character. Now, he's got a lot of men in power. What about your boy? Usually, he dies very early on and Helgi takes over, but look at that kingdom. That's impressive, really. They're fighting no one right now. Yeah, that was my old spy master. He passed on. His son is actually okay with me, I suppose. Now, why are you in debt? What are you doing, Bavaria? You're fighting a war. Ah, no wonder. You're fighting Kazaria. That's interesting. They're pretty far away, but you are allied to the Byzantine Empire. And the Byzantine Empire is why I want to have a hard time, because they're very close to me. Okay, before I get my army up, it's about time to go after a prince over here. You don't want to join me, so be it. I'll come take your territory. Now, I've got to move around my rally point. Perfect. We'll get everyone over here. I need no one else to help me. Not right now. My family is doing fine. I'm doing fine too. We've got only a few more days to go until we're ready. I've got to command. There. 32. I'm a young, powerful guy. And now it's time for a battle. I do outnumber them. I'm losing only a bit of money. Unfortunately, two of my commanders here, a duke and a count, are not getting on very well. Lambert, I shall support you. He's going to like me a lot more. And hopefully that'll avoid some issues. Usually, I do what I want in every campaign, but because of what's happened here, I've got to be very careful. And I think I have been, largely. What do we have now? Only four knights. But Dan's here. Dietrich too. Oh, you're done for. Good job, Dan. You've got their knight over there, and now we're besieging. I could use some Onagers. Okay. I lost only 75. I did gain 53 fame. That was a pretty good fight. Good job, Dan. Alright, so we got one of them. Oh, another battle. Well, you are quite foolish, but I do understand. If I take what they have now, it's over for them. It'll be all over for them. Come on. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We'll go up in speed. Who died? Well, Charles, you'll be swayed in time. Oh, a prisoner. Right, I've got prisoners. I shouldn't forget about them. Oh, you're actually fairly talented. 15 in prowess, I'll take you. I'm known for my dedication to my faith. True. Yeah, come join me, pal. I know you tried to rebel, but 15 prowess and 23 for Marshall? He's really not bad. Perfect. All right. Now, what do we have over here? Only 51 died. They did lose more. They're coming back. Adalberto. Oh, he's of age now. He's one elusive shadow. Incredible. Well, good for him. It's not good for me, but good for him. He's actually quite good in combat. He's not going to marry into my family, but he's going to marry a countess. Adalberto, you've got a lot of money. He's doing quite well. He's got power over here. He's been a very strong supporter of mine. Now, let's go back. I'll try to watch over his family when I'm able to. Lambert, you're being educated by your mother. Alright, we got them all. Their leader was wounded, no longer, but he was wounded. Let's have a look. How's that war going on way over here? Fascinating. Now that is a large group. I might not be able to help out. Have a look at that. Could I beat that many Vikings? Probably not. I wish I could, but I don't believe I can. Oh, we got him. Okay. Well, that belongs to me now. I've got over 2,000 men. I've got to disband my army for now. We need to rest up for a time. Done. But I've got more territory, and it directly belongs to me. All right, what do we have? We've got guild halls providing more development growth and gold. The Scuola Medica Serlantana was a medieval medical school. 
the first and most important of its kind. Situated on the Tyrrhenian Sea in the southern Italian city of Salerno, it was founded in the 9th century and rose to prominence in the 10th century, becoming the most important source of medical knowledge in Western Europe at the time. I'm only reading these here because it's really cool to learn more about history and also important locations too. So if we build it, no wait, we don't need to build it, right, we have it. Two to my taxes over here, which is incredible. Plus 20% to development growth. All right, very nice. And if I hold it, I get a medium boost to my health. And I can live for two more years in addition to more lifestyle experience and more learning per level of devotion. Fascinating. Well, I do like that. Hopefully, I'm going to live for a very, very long time. But I've got my new territory now. I wonder what else we have around here. That's a good question. I've got 312 gold. I'm making a lot of gold currently. I could certainly get more soldiers, and I do need to. Warhounds do seem to be interesting, but I need Onagers too. I've got to have a few. But not only that, I could also use some pikemen. If we want to counter horsemen, we do need pikemen. I've got 14 knights total, and I'm still making a lot of money. It's going to take them time to get all together. You should be my capital now that I think about it. A question of loyalty. I'm going to look into it. I've got to be the father. There's no way I'm not. She has no other friends. Who do you know? Yeah. I did investigate, but things are fine. All right. Thank you, Rudolph. Brother, I wish you were a little bit more subtle over there. Let's have a look at the map again. Oh, a dangerous faction. We're about to have a new rebellion. Duke Lambert again. See, there's a big issue over here. I'm not his rightful leader, as you can see right down over here. Minus five. That's because right now, the Pope has that title. If I take it, it'll cause me a few issues, but we'll see in time. Bavaria, you're once again losing money. You've got a rebellion to fight. East Francia, you're losing two wars currently. Wow. They are not doing well. And over here, Lothair? Oh, he's doing very well. He's fine. And over to the west. He's wealthy. He's got a lot of prestige. He's got all the power that he needs. Now, Kent. I do want to help you out. I really, really do, man. But have a look at that monstrosity of an army. There's two of them, in fact. Oh, man. If I had more men, if I had more money and more men, then maybe I would be okay with it. Okay, so I'm trying to get more control right now. My council is doing fine. I also do need a new claim. We could try to get a new claim. Why not over here in Benevento? I think that could be quite good. Or we could keep on going down. Now, you've got many allies. 2,000 men. 200. All right. You would probably outnumber me. If I try to get your duchy, it would be a holy war. We've got to get it, I think. We should get it. I think it's a good idea to pick it up. But I also do want Benevento as well. Very good. So now we've got plans. I don't need money from the Pope right now. And as I make more money, I'll be able to do so much more. Wait, hold on. If I get more gold, I can send a child to university? Really? You're kidding me. That's incredibly cool. All right, who do I have over here? A daughter of mine. 475 gold. Wow. All right. That's going to have to wait. I want to, but I can't afford it right now. Look, university's not cheap. I'm still a dad. I've got bills to pay, man. All right. Rowdy, you're rowdy. If not Marshall, then what about Intrigue? It'll be Intrigue. Okay, we need a good educator for you, child. Who's it going to be? Probably your uncle. Yeah, it's going to be your uncle. There. You're not going to university right now. Sorry. You're just a baby. What's over here? Curious? All right. I'll give you learning too. Let's find you again a good educator. Who's it going to be? The old man? Sure, the old man. That'll do it. How's my boy doing? I think he's doing fine. Yeah, he's pretty educated. Not a great warrior. But we'll see in time what he'll be capable of doing. Lambert over here. He's a bit better at fighting. Oh, speaking of warriors, what about my dwarf? There's Adalberto. 25 prowess. Dan is quite powerful. Oh, Klaus. He's over there. 
Here we go, Harold. Wait, you've got two children? Good for you, Harold. One's a dwarf, a very strong dwarf, who's also fertile. Ugh. Then over here, a strong giant baby. Interesting. You've had twins. He's like, look at me. I've got some very, very short seed, but it's very dangerous over short distances, okay? I get it. You know how to sprint. All right, buddy? Oh, yeah. He's lost over here. There's no way for me to help him out. I wish, but there's no way. Yeah, we'll continue to placate King Charles. I've got to watch out for him. And we'll probably have a holy war over here, but I've got to wait and watch out for what may happen over here. There could be a major rebellion, and I do not want them to come after me. Okay, so you are contributing a lot of power. If I could stop you, that would truly be good. But I can't do it right now. As much as I want to. I could do that, but that would be an act of tyranny, so we've got to avoid it. I've got another child. We shall call her Anna. Beautiful. Alright, so I've got another child. Despite being chased, and I'm only 38, I'm getting older. But I'm not quite there yet. Now, what about that new war? Let's check on that rebellion. It's been a little bit of time. Maybe we'll be okay. And I do not want you to be okay. I've got to take over some territory. Let's do it right now. I'm going to call in my allies. I feel like I should. Count Combo, you're still alive? He's pretty old, too. Well, good for him. Come over here. Help me out. Here's a petty king. How much power do you have? 2,900, we'll take it. And the King of Kent. Oh, I am very sorry. Poor Wessex. But there's no way for me to beat that. It was by far way too many. Now, let's get ready. We need to go fight again, I think. Everyone's alive, everyone is doing well. We just need to get our army together. Raise all here. Every single soldier that you can get. Get them all together. Good, good, good. That's what I wanted. They're beginning to join on in. I'm going to lead our army into battle. Oh, they've got a new alliance already. That was quick. It could be a very dangerous one. I'm only at 27 now. Improved pillaging, excuse me? All right. It's about time to move. Let's go attack. We've got to figure out what we can do. Oh, a countess. You're evidently powerful. Right, you're married to Adalberto. You've got over 800 men. She's actually quite powerful. I remember you. Your father and your brother died. And here you are, actually doing quite well. You married Adalberto. That's quite a bit of power. Look at that. The Countess of Lombardia has married into Tuscany. That's interesting. I wonder how that might play out for them. We shall see in time. All right. It's about time to go take whatever we can. We're about to get more control. And I'm here to take over. Let's have a look at that war. I've got more soldiers right now, but who knows what other friends they might bring in. But I do want Calabria back. We've got to retake these lands for the church. We've got to do that. All right, we've got a new perk. I've got King's Guard for more knights. What else do I want over here? More control. That's an option. Naval speed up. Let's see, my siege weapons would be better. More movement speed. Tactics too. I do like that. Dealing more damage pleases me. We'll do that real quick. Yeah. Thank you, Adalberto. He's quite active. All right. Go train my boys. Now, you could gain more control in a few locations. It wouldn't take you too much time. Like over here, three months. We'll do that. It's a good way to avoid some issues. Oh, they're angry. In three months, we're going to have a problem. Oh, no. Flora, why? How could you, Flora? All right. We're going to have a civil war. I'm going to have to fight it. Let's wait and watch out, I suppose. My wife is trying to help out as much as she's able to. What's over here? We're not going to assault. That would be a bad idea. King Charles, he loves me right now. Oh, there they have over 900 men. We'll watch out for them, too. Now, who else do we have? Let's see over here. They've got another leader. What about you, Genoa? Over 500. 
I'm gonna sway you, lady. I'll try to. Here we go. It's about time for another war. What's over here? Well, first off, we know that that one adventurer has a new ally, Rorik. If he joins in, he's doomed. I appear to have interrupted a heated debate. A few of my courtiers and servants have been discussing rumors they heard about a distant land known as the Isle of Colors, where men and women are like us except for one thing. Their skin is an unnatural color. What my courtiers cannot seem to agree on, however, is what that skin color is. Interesting. I've got many options over here. You know what? Sure. We'll say pink. I'll gain more prestige. It was only a little conversation. Alright. They're not trying to come for me just yet, but any day now, it's going to happen. We did it. Oh, it's over. We got him. Okay, you were easy. It took me only eight months. That's a good thing. Now, why don't we go home and rest up? I just gained a lot of land. I've got to give away some land. And I wonder who I should give it to. Oh, look over here. Has anything been built? Nothing at all. These are very poor locations. I do feel like there's one fellow who does deserve land. Harold, I like you. We've got to do it. I've got to do it. Let's have a look over here. All right, you're part of a duchy, Calabria. I could give you every single location. I'll give you two of them, or yeah, two of them. That'll be fair, I think. There's one. He's my vassal now. Nice haircut, buddy. Very stylish. Now we've got another fellow who probably deserves a bit of land. It's got to be Dan. Or even Klaus. He's been great too, but... If we look at Dan, Dan's quite powerful. He's been great. Oh, come on. You've got your old job back. You deserve it, buddy. Don't worry about it. He's like, all right, I'll do it for you. I love to make people laugh. All right, Dan, you've got no kids. You need kids. So I'll give you one location. You can serve a dwarf. Now, I am ambitious. It'll cause me some issues. I'll have to wait until I conquer more then. I don't want to become stressed out. But I've got five locations now. It's not making me that much money, but that's okay. I could always give away lands back over here in the north. I mean, that's another option. But once more, I need more territory because I do not want to be stressed out. But there we go. We've got even more. Let's come over here to my court because I've got some prisoners. I don't want to kill all of you. 20 for stewardship? Really? I might recruit him. And for you? No, you're not very good. Oh, that's your wife. Okay. And you have many children. I don't want to anger all of your children. That's how you get people trying to kill you in your sleep. You're like, oh, hi, nice person. And then they shank you because they have a huge family. All right, so I've got over 300 gold right now. We do need our army to go home. Ah, there we go. I've got to fight them, don't I? I do. Okay. It's going to be a big one. They've got a lot of men. But we're going to track them down. What now? You want to give me some money? I'll take that. Wait. Only a claim on a county. No, I need a duchy claim. Go back to work, Roberto. Come back home and read your Bible once you're done getting my claim. And here's another ransom. Oh my god. You're a factory woman. I'm meant to be chased and here you are wringing me dry. Look at how many children we have. Hopefully it's another daughter. That would benefit our faction quite a bit. Let's come over here. Can I catch him? I can catch him. Oh, hold on. We'll switch over back to me. I've got all of my knights here now. 14 knights total. We should be able to cut through them. Now for Mortified. Oh, you're raiding in my territory? Hold on. He's pretty far away, though. Shoot. All right. I'll be back. I'm going to come back for him. Don't worry about it. Now, they do have a lot of men over here. And unfortunately, that Jarl won. There goes Kent. All of Kent. We've got our Crusader Kings. Deus Volt. Well, good. I'm going to need that. Because one day, we're going to retake England. That might be a goal of mine. But I'm not sure yet. I'll think about it. It depends on where we get to conquer in the future. But here we go. It's time for a major battle. They have many, many men. Oh, there's my niece. I got her. Kind of a weird way to meet her for the first time, or for the first time in a very long time. 
It's been a brutal battle. They do have 16 knights total. One knight was maimed, unfortunately. They've got a few decent people, like Adalberto. Oh, the son. He's over here. He's got a beard, too. I can't believe your own wife turned you against me. I was your teacher. <gasps> there we go. Good job. One of our knights got a kill. And there we go. Count Suppo, you've been maimed. Bernhard did a good job. And we beat them. It wasn't easy, but we did it. We did lose over 300 men. They lost over 1,000 men. I gained 201 fame. My knights killed 802. Theirs killed 121. Their levies were torn apart. Their pikemen killed. They did have a lot of men in arms. They really did. Now, what's over here? Oh, he died. What a shame. Well, he's gone now. We've got a Countess of Enkona. Right over here. Yeah, it's a bit further away. I caught a few other people, too. He's dead. Oh, he was only 17. What a shame. Who got him? Harold. <gasps> My dwarf killed him. I mean, Harold killed him. I can't call him a dwarf like that. Sounds mean. Yeah. He killed how many people? 66 men were killed by him. He's like, I'm half of a man, but I can kill a whole of you. Or I can put a hole in you. Anyway. He got him. All right. We're done here. Adalberto also got a kill. He's a very mighty fellow. I can't believe he's having to fight against his own child. That's got to be wrong. Let's come over here and take what we can. We've got to, I think. Or we could go after... Well, it depends. We could come over here to finish off all the peasants. I don't know when our little rebellions shall end, but it's going to take a long time. They have a lot going on. Another boy. Nikolaus. That shall be your name. Oh, you take after your mother. Wonderful. Speaking of children, all of you are educated, correct? You should be. All right. And what about you? Oh, you're very young. I don't know what you're going to be like yet. Can I catch him? I don't believe I can. I'll come over here anyway. Ah, darn it. They got away. We'll come back. No, don't go overseas, okay? I don't want to be on a boat. I just want to come over here and fight. Let's go down. I've got a new unpressed claim. Interesting. No, I don't want to go over there. I'm not going to fight the papacy. A few people want me to, but I can't do that anytime soon. They've got the money and power to destroy me. I can't do that right now. Oh, really? An even battle? Well, I do hate that. It's a shame. But I've got to go in, I think. Okay. Unfortunately, one knight was maimed. We're holding. We're beating them. Their casualties are beginning to go up. Count Guy was wounded by our guy. We lost over 600 so far. Come on. Yeah, they have a lot more when it comes to men in arms. Count Guy is dead. Ha <laughs> ha. That's my man over there. Cutting people down. Come on, knights. You can do it. They got him. All right, so we have changed up the culture. It took many, many years, but we now have our culture over here. Get to work again. Your job is never done. I am very sorry. We do need a new master of the horse very well. I remember you. Get over here. All right. You can marry someone. Sure. Enjoy. Let's go back. We've got to try to help out. Countess Flora, you traitor. You're not going to take Adalberta away from me. Oh, we got her. Great. Okay. Well, she's over here. Those two are now getting married. If you look at it, though, I didn't lose a lot. Good. Only 186. They did lose 890. She was captured. My knights killed 628. And what happened over here? Right. One kill. Three captures. We've got to chase them down again, don't we? I suppose we do. I do want to find their peasants. I bet they're coming down over here. Let's move. I've got to find them. Oh, he's moving away. Hold on. We don't want to go that far. I'm not here to lose too many soldiers. But I'm going to chase down any peasants they have. No. Keep on working. Come on, Roberto. Oh, he's dead. Right, he was maimed. Ah, poor guy. 
He did a good job. Two of my counselors were married. Now we need someone new. Well, goodbye, my friend. You did serve me well. well you're not very good, but I'll take you. I've got to take you. Yeah, work on Vassal Opinion. That's what I need from you right now. I need people to like me. He fought and died well. Alright, let's get him. More peasants over here. Sultan Muhammad won. Interesting. Hold on, we need to know what they're doing because they're very close to me. So he did take a lot of land. Understood. He's got a lot of power. I'm getting more power, but I do not compare, not yet. How's Bavaria doing? You know what, we'll look at them later. I'm busy right now. I need to focus on my current war. Oh, we got him, good. It took some time, but we got him. He's been captured. They're all in trouble. I've been winning my wars. And I've got plenty of money. Oh, look at how much money I have now. Or a favor. I could get money or a favor. Ah. Give me money. Here's another mayor. 30 gold. I could use a lot of money, actually. Now, Duke Lambert. I don't really care for you. I'm gonna get a weak hook. Yeah, you're pretty broke anyway. Aldo Rico, you have no lands at all. I'll let you go too. Count Supo, 50 gold. I'll let him go for now. Only because I could use all of that gold. It's a lot of gold. Okay, done. We finally did it. We beat them. Let's have a look over here again. There's a new Norse leader over here. We've got Sigurd, who's still very much alive. Mercia is somehow still going. Well, good for them. They're allied to me. I don't know if I can help him out. Here's Jorvik. He's got a lot of men. I wouldn't be able to beat him. Not yet. Alba, you're holding on right now. But they're losing two wars and probably about to lose another. They're fighting three wars. Oh, they're done for. There's no way. Ivar. Wow. He's pretty old. He's got plenty of children. Yeah, he'll be okay. Now, what about Harold? Haraldir. <laughs> One-legged? I mean, he got messed up early on. He's not a bad leader. And over here, Rurik again. 4,500 men, still very much alive. He's not feeling great, though. And he might not be around forever. And the Byzantine Empire. Oh. House Macedon. They are still doing well. He's got a pretty decent air. He's well read at the very least. All right, so I've got over 500 gold. And I've got you too. I don't have to hold on to you. Yeah, get out of here. Give me some money again. Now, there's a lot I can do here. I could declare a war of my own. I could also build up a new building. And I do believe I want to do that. I could use a new capital, but... I'll have to move it again later. A new duchy building one day. But I'm making so much money. I would like to make more. There we are. Look at that. 500 gold. If I do it now, it's only going to benefit me later on. We've got to do it now. Alright, it'll be done in 889, many years from now. There really isn't a major war I want to fight right now. And I do not believe it'll be a good idea. I don't have a lot of prestige, I've got a decent amount of piety, and I do not have a lot of gold saved up right now. One day I'll have more. So we've got to begin by taking what we can get. Like over here, look at you, a weakling. Holy war, 40 piety, I've got 40 piety. Okay everyone, get together, I've got my men together now, we don't need too many soldiers. That should do it, 1800 men, yeah. That'll do it, I'll take command. Not you, Adalberto, me. I know you're very good, but you're not gonna be here as long as I am. 50 more gold given to me. I could use that gold to upgrade one of my groups over here. They're done. I now have more armored footmen. They counter spearmen. I do like them a lot, they're pretty tough. We'll keep on upgrading over time because I do need a very elite army. Oh, you've got a new friend. Sheik Kamal, the plane. He's not going to make it here in time, I don't believe so. If he does, good for him. Oh, we got him. They were butchered. We caught many of them, too. But that'll make me a bit more money. Alright, continue. 
Go on. You know what to do. Yeah, they've got more allies over there. My boys are doing well, and we are done. Well, hold on. Yeah, let them come fight me. I'll capture anyone I can get. Ha, perfect. All right, the war is over. Imagine coming by with a group of like 90 men, and you're like, don't worry, we're here to help. You arrive, you're completely outnumbered. That would feel awful. All right, so over here, I'm gonna pick up, let's see, more movement speed, I'll take that. Now I'm gonna work on diplomacy because I could use more prestige. Majesty focus, I'll get plus one to diplomacy and one prestige per month. Perfect. That's gonna help out a lot. I've got one too many locations right now. I'm gonna give it over to Dan. Dan is a very good knight, I like him a lot. Okay, Dan, you're one option. Klaus, you're another one. You're not a bad guy. Eventually, I'll give you territory. Oh, no. You've got the pox. You too? What about your kid? Your kid's okay. All right, Dan. Here's your title. 38 prowess. Wow. He's also deaf. So, I'm going to write him a letter. I'll give you that location. Enjoy. Please do not die. Please do well. Okay? But he's got his own territory now. We're done over here. Wait, hold on. Raiders? In my territory? Oh, no, I don't think so. Let's go get them. We've got to. We're coming down to visit. I can't believe you did that. Who's over here? Maximos, huh? He's Greek and Sunni. And he's a dead nerd. Yeah, we cut right through them. We got them. I got back, what, 29 gold and 15 prestige, too. So we did a pretty good job. Got rid of another faction. That's why we need to go find them. They've been raiding in my territory for far too long. That's beginning to anger me quite a bit. Let's move back because I do need to disband my army. Oh, wait, more hostiles? Oh, no, 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 it's only that group. I thought I wiped them out. But they do have men left. All right, so we're back. Now, I wonder... Oh, that would be a major war. Look at that. No wonder. He's got protection. I could come over here. He's got only 900 men. He's a Sardinian. A very well-fed Sardinian. What else do we have? Let's see here. We should come down over here. And there should be a mine right down over here, too. Yeah. We could get a new building to help make more money. I do like that idea. I think we'll go over there. Now, is it going to be expensive? Oh, you've got a claim. Okay, 188. No, no, no. It's way too much. I don't want to do that. You've got two allies. They're not that powerful. Oh, that one is. Wow, 1,900 men. He's got a lot. If I get drawn into a bloody war, that wouldn't be great for me. But we could do it, potentially. A duchy. Do you even have a duchy title? Oh, you do. Well, how about that? We'll take it. 80 piety. All right. I need all of you again to get together. But now we'll take every single soldier. I need everyone together. All right. We've got some time to go. And we are now ready. Wait, who died? <gasps> Adalberto, no. He died of old age. Look at him. Look at how strong he was, even though he was so old. Even when he was infirm, he could be like, Water, please, and just snap your neck. Wow. There goes my alliance, which is a shame. I might break up that marriage later. Let's go down and conquer what should belong to us. Oh, we need a better landing zone. All right, we'll find out where we can land. Now your son, all your two sons over here have power. One is over in Corsica. Right. That is correct. So you're over here. You're not very good. Great beard, though. Your other boy, he's very good. He's a vassal of mine, not a friend of mine. He's got no children yet. And his wife is quite powerful, too. 880 men. She's Lombardian. Or, she lives over there. Alright. Let's go. Oh! My brother died! Many people are dying already. He's got two children. Eventually, I'm going to bring them over into my court. No, you don't need to marry him. You'll marry who I want you to marry. I'm going to bring him over. But my brother, 
The one who betrayed me, he passed on. He's gone now. What happened? Natural causes at 43? Can you tell me about what that might be? Because I'm his blood. I can't believe I've lost two brothers already. One in battle, one to old age. Rudolph is over here. I hope you're feeling okay. He's a bit stressed out, yeah? Oh, you got more gold. Well, that's good. You were coordinated by the Pope, which is insane. No wonder you were in debt. Okay, he's currently fighting a rebellion. He might win. We'll see. Now, what's over here? We are preparing for war. A papal envoy has reached my court. Bringing news from the Vatican. What if I told him I wasn't here? No, I live way too close. We've got to do it. We're going for Jerusalem. We've got to do it. I'm going to help out, sure. There. We need to go finish our current war. I'll think about it. Oh, it's got to be one of these two? Really? That's a shame. She's a bit younger. I'll think about it. All right. What do you have over here? You've got a lot of men. You're losing one war to the Byzantine Empire. That's a really good thing. That war is still going on. The Abbasids are mighty. Adalberto, my brother. Two old friends gone. I'm only 41 now. What's over here? A county? No, I need a duchy claim. And we shall have one, one day. We'll come over here. Okay, he's leaving. We need to wait for that penalty to go away before we can move. Otherwise, we're done for. Well, not done for, but we would lose far too many. Come on now. All right, it's gone. Let's go fight them. You're not going to command. Oh, I can let you do it. You're my friend. But no, I'll do it. A dead prisoner. He wasn't very good. All right. Even tempered. I was watching Eberhard play with other children when Seiko tried to push him over. Forgiving? I don't know if I want you to be forgiving. You're going to be a ruler. Yeah, be angry. There's a bit of stress for me, but that's all right. Oh, they do have a lot of men. But they did disembark. We've got a shot. We can do it. We need to push now. Come on. Get into it. We are beginning now. A man worthy of praise over here. So, Duchess Flora, you're telling me about your husband, Adalberto. All right. He's okay. I'm not mad at him. He's number two. Hopefully, he'll have great children as well. All right. Let's continue to fight now. Oh, no. Andre, you were maimed. Wait. They've got some decent knights over there. Let's fight on. We're winning. It wasn't easy, but we are winning. I'm a much better commander. Battle for Tully. All right. We'll go chase him down. Wait, who are you? I guess I'll go fight you too. We did lose only 254. Man, that equipment looks really cool. Dan killed 94. Rudolph, 70. That's my brother. He's a really good fighter, better than me. All right, Dietrich, you got to kill. Not bad. 18 prowess, yeah. Killed in battle. We're back over here. We'll keep on fighting. We've got to. We can't rest up too much. All right. We'll come over here now. 1,200 men to fight. We can catch them. We can do it. I didn't lose a lot over here, did I? No, I did not. They're gone. That crusade, I'll join in on. But we need to finish up over here. Hopefully, we can catch their leader. That's my goal right now don't have a lot of money. We would be undefended, but maybe we would be okay. Our rolls are not going well. They have more men. Oh, Andre. He's going to die soon. I was wounded. Only briefly, though. Okay. That was a bit nerve-wracking. But we made it. We got him. All right, we'll come back over here. I caught more of them. Thank you, my wife. 274 see here we captured many all right let's go down and do what we can to say ah hello yeah my greetings are pretty deadly you don't want me saying hello if you ever know i'm coming to say hello it's probably a war it's probably war i could imprison him really oh you try to kill a family member okay he's got one leg i think i'll wait 
but that would be a good way to get rid of him. I want to get rid of his title. That's really what I want. All right. We beat them again. Let it be over. It's not over. Shoot. They are very stubborn. I'm getting more devotion and fame. It's actually good to fight Holy Wars. It benefits me a lot. Oh, good job, young man. But he was injured. Quite a bit, too. We're not done. We've got to go fight. Doesn't matter. We've got to go. I'm going to chase him down. I got him again. We'll get him. Grow fonder. To nurture relationships between the next generation of rulers is a duty we should not neglect. Okay. You could get to know Alda over here. Antonella. You're an option too. No, she's got a funny foot. We'll choose the other girl. There, have a friend. I was hoping for someone better, but that don't have to do, I suppose. Alright, we got another leader, but we're not done yet. We've got to wait for a bit. I've got to go take... What? Only their capital. It shouldn't take too long. Here we go. The time has finally come to bring St. George's holy wrath against the vile infidels of Jerusalem. We'll be over there later. I'm going to finish up my war over here. We'll take a brief moment to breathe, recuperate, then we're off. I think right now I'm going to call a few allies to war. Because they called in their own ally, I need some help here. So come on down. You too, king. You've got time and power, I think. 150? Hold on. That's a lot. What about you, Earl? Oh, good. You've got some territory left. I was hoping you survived. Alright, 1,300 men? That should do it. Yeah, that should be sufficient. I like that. Now, when it comes to what we gain, if we do get to fight in that crusade, I'll give my territory over to my sister. She's got children. Done. Wow. Look at those comparable numbers. Incredible. Yeah, hopefully I can join in over there and help out. Man, Count, you've been a great friend to me. I'm glad that we're kind of family. I mean, you are my brother-in-law. You've got over here my nieces and my nephews, too. All right, they're coming. Let's get ready and take over a new location. What's over here? My cousin was captured. Really? I wonder who beat him. Oh, he was destroyed. Look at that. A little over 500 men left. Ludwig, you are not doing well. And here comes another Jarl. Those Vikings are no joke. Look at that little girl beat him. Oh, King. You are shaming us all over here. Charles, you're doing fine. That's good. Lothair, you're holding on. Ludwig, you can do a better job. You have no sons. Not a single one? Okay, we might need to go up north one day to reclaim what should belong to us. We shall see in time. I don't want to lose every bit of land to barbarians, to vikings. Here we go, finally! Benevento. Haha, <laughs> we can take all of it. I'll go into debt, though. Shoot. Alright. Hold on. What we can do, we can come over here. And ransom a few people. 30 gold, we'll take that. Another 30 gold. Very good. I know we're letting them go, but I need the money. Are you any good, by the way? You're a decent commander, but no. You're not leaving. You're not leaving. It shall be mine. Okay, we are no longer in debt. We're doing fine. I have a new claim. A very good one, too. Oh, they made it over here. Hello there. He's back. We beat him. It was a very easy battle. Okay, so we captured many of your knights. Good, good. Oh man, all these new mods have made the game so much fun. I'm going to play so many new campaigns to let you know. Who's over here? Who died? Ah, I don't really know you. You're one persistent fellow, but we finally beat them. Finally! Okay, the war is over. It took me 20 months, but it's over. You've made me age, okay? I'm angry at you. But it's all done over there. Now, what about the rebels? In half a year, they're coming for me. Okay, I've got to find a way to potentially appease them all. We'll come back to my council. I do need a new marshal. It shall be you. He's a duke, a very powerful one. For a minor title for a court champion, we'll take Klaus. Klaus is very good. There he is. 
All right. Now we could use more control. 32 days. Take it now. Do it now. We need more peace over here. I own one too many locations. I might give it to Klaus. I could do that. He wouldn't be my champion anymore, but I do like him. We could find someone who's got some decent learning as well. I've got some options over here on what I can do. You know what, Klaus? You have been loyal for a very long time. I know you've got the pox, but wear that helmet and we'll be okay. There. Much better. He's a new vassal of mine. We'll come back over here. Let's see. To my council. I need a new champion again. And it shall be you, my old friend. You've got some kids, say. Hey. All right. If we have a look at everything, we need to plan out our future battles. We'll be over here fighting, and it won't be easy. We could potentially lose all of our men, but we also need to first handle another rebellion. It's going to happen very soon. But let me know what you believe that we should do, my council, and we'll be back tomorrow. Until then. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Things have become rather interesting, and we're going to have some drama pretty darn soon. Now, as a brief reminder before I let you enjoy the music, don't forget to check out my game store right down below. You can buy official keys, you can pre-order games like Warhammer 3, Crusader Kings 3, and other types of games that you enjoy and that I enjoy as well. So do check it out right down below, and... I would also like to give out a quick shout out to the Sexy Swede, a longtime patron and subscriber of the channel. Thank you so much, man, for all that you've done. You've been a great friend to me, and I look forward to future streams too. Which, by the way, I'll be streaming again very soon if you want to find out where. It's also right down below on Twitch. I've got a link there. Click it. You should do it.